guys and girls and welcome back to Dragon Quest XI! We're in the palace. Bottom floor. Why does this sound like Disney music? And why are they bearing down all the wells? There's a book called Adrian Geof uh, Geographic. Even takes a show from the example of many nations, both large and small, that make up Idria. There are five. The so called Great Five that stands above all the others in the eyes of the world. Ancient, honorable. Dundrazeal, Steadfast, Stony, Halidor. The Lopus with its noble Desert Knights? Sniffleheim with the snow capped towers? Glass, but what needs? Swadrost. Carpet in flowers. These five nations guide the world meeting every few years a great compliment. Known to the colony of the kings, in order to steer the course of Adrian affairs in the direction agreeable to all. Cabin. This is a way you play an RPG. Look in every nook and cranny. Sorry if that's kind of boring maybe for you, but this is how I want to play this game.
Why do I have a feeling that this letter will end in like an awesome dungeon? didn't see many of these pots. Uh, I guess let's continue with the story. I don't want to have another episode with nearly nothing happening. <laughs> will be quite close enough. Welcome to Heliodor Castle, friend. No, oh, can you say it with warm elephants or whatever the word is in English? The jewel of Dundrasil. You are bold indeed to have made your way here alone, wanderer. I am Carnelian. Ruler of Heliodor. How long have I waited for this day? And now, finally, we meet. Truly, it is an honor. The fact that you come here proffering the jewel and asking to speak with me personally would suggest that you know something of your true nature. I take it that you also bear the mark? Yes, the mark of light. Then there is no doubt, you are he. You are he is a weird word. Rejoice, dear subjects. The day is upon us at last. The luminary walks among us once more. <laughs> Tell me. Oh, Luminary, where exactly is it that you hail from? I would so very much like to pay tribute to those who took you in and raised you. Oh, no, don't, don't, don't! I see. Cobblestone, you say? Jasper, you know of this place? I do, my liege. A village of provincial nobodies deep in the rocky south. Then I take it you know what to do. Do not disappoint me. Oh, I have such a bad feeling about that. God damn it, if they kill everyone in there, I will be pissed. Yes, my liege.
cursed luminary. I know not what your intent was in coming here alone, but whatever your wicked scheme, know that it shall not succeed. What? A curse? <clears throat> Hendrik, take this cur, this harbinger of calamity, and cast him into the furthest corner of the dungeon. Know this. The luminary is the root of all evil and will bring naught but misery to our realm. And why is this? The reason is simple. Just as light is intertwined with darkness, so too is the luminary intertwined with the dread lord of shadows. His coming heralds the resurrection of the Dark One. Did you really think you could fool one as wise as his majesty? It was your great misfortune to confront one who knows your true nature. Okay. Men, seize this wretch! Okay. Did he block me? You claim to hail from Cobblestone. Well, before the sun has set three times, we shall know the truth. By then, Jasper will have returned from his investigation. If I were you, Dark Spawn, I would not expect to live beyond that day. Hmm. Okay. Will you keep it down in there? Most folks they throw in here have the decency to wait a while before going stir crazy. What are you in for, anyhow? You don't get free bed and board down here without having done something pretty bad. Wait, did you save the luminary? You're serious? <sighs> You're telling me the luminary has just shown up in the cell next to mine. This is crazy. One plate of delicious gruel for a gentleman in the dungeon suite. Come and get it. Okay. Are you friend or are you foe? The luminary. You're serious? Just show him your mark. So it's all happening just like the seer said it would. 
Uh, see, uh, that's uh, the person that sees into the future. We'd better get out of here. Wait here. Don't worry, I didn't kill him. But he won't be waking up anytime soon. Things will get pretty hairy up ahead. You'd be oh, and I found this in a corner over there. I get me? I got this little beauty back, so now I'm pretty much unstoppable. Who are you? We better get out of here before any more of our tin. <clears throat> so let's get moving! I spend ages digging the... Guess I really was meant to help you out. Just like the seer said. Anyway, there'll be time to talk about all that later. In the hole, you go. Let me see if there's... be probably coming here later on. Ah, oh, god damn it. Cutscene! The sewers, huh? Well, there must be a way out somewhere. Lead the way. I got your back. Hmm. So we're party. I cannot like this stuff. Make ourselves skip. <coughs> okay, so keep running.
God damn it. God damn it! I am bad at sneaking. Another one bites the Hey, that's what I say. Okay, I, I, I sneak at least once. <laughs> well, we These go in the water. They're too heavy. Seriously? and heavy uh, armory. Otherwise, we would drown like shit. Where well, shit does not drown, it floats. Uh. <sighs> An angel statue! You okay? Looks like we shook the guards, at least. And that looks like a way out. Maybe I'll... Yeah, maybe we have a chance. But let me save, let me save, let me save! So, I hope you enjoyed this episode. See you next time. Bye!